Mavs hosting the Pistons, and the Mavs are four and a half point favorites. The over under is at 223 and a half. The Pistons are plus 164 on the money line, and the Mavs are minus 205. Now, this is actually a back to back for the Pistons, which I'm surprised they actually did that in the preseason. I must stress this, and I can't stress this enough. This is pre confirmed lineups and pre tip off lineups. This is the preseason. They love to hold on to the lineups as long as they possibly can. Use Rotowire or Underdog on Twitter. They usually have the most accurate lineups, but you're going to have to wait because it's almost 9 o'clock in the morning here on the West Coast, and this game is slated for 5 o'clock my time. Thank you for everyone who has joined the Discord and who continues to join the Discord. If you've not done so yet, go to my website, rawsportstalk.com. It is a paid membership, but it will give you access to my best bets. Head-to-head, the home team is on a two-game winning streak. The home team is 7-3. and three. The Mavericks are 7-3. and three. The underdog has covered the last two games. The favorite is 5-4-1 against the spread. The favorite is 9-1 on the money line. The over is 6-4, and, and the under 223.5 is 6-4. and four. Those stats are based off of the regular season and not the preseason. Uh, it looks like Bogdanovich and Morris are listed as game-time decisions. Livers is listed as out. And then Donachich, Curry, Green, Hardy, are, and Morris are all listed as game-time decisions. So pretty much the entire starting lineup for the Mavericks game time decisions in the preseason there's been 234 253 and 256 points for the pistons and for the mavericks 250 200 and 210 neither one of these teams seemingly played uh, defense and it seems like a trap that this over under is just so low with how many points the pistons have been giving up but if the mavericks don't play any of their starters it completely makes sense of why it is as low as what it is because I have doubts about how many players the Mavericks are going to play, I'll take them to win the game. I don't think they cover, and I think that this game goes under just because of the back-to-back. If the Pistons didn't play a back-to-back, I'd probably take them on the money line. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.